Today, we will talk about the Great Leap Forward, what it was, goals, and impact. The Great Leap Forward was a five-year plan of forced agricultural collectivization and rural industrialization that was instituted by the Chinese Communist Party in 1958, which resulted in a sharp contraction in the Chinese economy and between 30 to 45 million deaths by starvation, execution, torture, forced labor, and suicide out of desperation. It was the largest single, non-wartime campaign of mass killing in human history. In 1958, Mao announced his plan for the Great Leap Forward, which he laid out as a five-year plan to improve the economic prosperity of the People's Republic of China. He devised the plan after touring China and concluding that he felt the Chinese people were capable of anything. Overall, the plan was centered around two primary goals, collectivizing agriculture, and widespread industrialization, with two main targets, increasing grain and steel production. Private plot farming was abolished and rural farmers were forced to work on collective farms where all production, resource allocation, and food distribution was centrally controlled by the Communist Party. Large-scale irrigation projects, with little input from trained engineers, were initiated, and experimental, unproven new agricultural techniques were quickly introduced around the country. These innovations resulted in declining crop yields from failed experiments and improperly constructed water projects. Famine quickly set in across the countryside, resulting in millions more deaths. Large-scale state projects to increase industrial production were introduced in urban areas, and backyard steel furnaces were built on farms and in urban neighborhoods. Due to the failures in planning and coordination, and resulting materials shortages, the massive increase in industrial investment and reallocation of resources resulted in no corresponding increase in manufacturing output. The increase in urban populations placed additional strain on the food distribution system and demand on collective farms to increase grain production for urban consumption. The Great Leap Forward ended up being a massive failure. Tens of millions died by starvation, exposure, overwork, and execution in just a few years. Farmland was damaged by nonsensical agricultural practices and the landscape denuded of trees to fuel the steel furnaces. 30 to 40 percent of the housing stock was demolished. The Great Leap Forward was officially halted in January 1961 after three brutal years of death and destruction. Here are five key takeaways. 1. The Great Leap Forward was a five-year economic plan executed by Mao Zedong and the Chinese Communist Party, begun in 1958 and abandoned in 1961. 2. The goal was to modernize the country's agricultural sector using communist economic ideologies. 3. Instead of stimulating the country's economy, the Great Leap Forward resulted in mass starvation and famine. 4. It is estimated that between 30 and 45 million Chinese citizens died due to famine, execution, and forced labor, along with massive economic and environmental destruction. 5. The Great Leap Forward remains the largest episode of non-wartime mass killing in human history, and a clear example of the failures of socialism and economic central planning. Hope this would help, thanks for watching.